Oh, sir, reads a lot. Well, hi there, Dr. G. Well, how are you doing today? I'm doing fantastic. Oh, boy, you're nice and chipper today. It's a beautiful fall here in Ohio. You know, we've got fall sports going on. We've got volleyball, and we've got football, and we've got, you know, all the other great stuff that's happening. Well, what about jousting? It seems that you forgot to mention that. Uh, you know what? Unfortunately, we do not have a jousting team here at Lakewood. No jousting? But that's... That's like my livelihood. I know it is. I know it is. It is not an OHSAA approved sport. Um, and I don't foresee that happening anytime real soon. But Well, if anything, let me know. I'll come coach Lakewood. I'll tell you what. Why don't I do that? I'll t tell you when we do get that sport. Perhaps you and uh, your friend there, Sir Lancelot, the ah, coach. My nemesis. Yeah, I know. Sorry, I didn't mean to bring him up again. But, well... Hopefully, uh, you guys will do some coaching with that. Well, I got to tell you what. I got a special guest for you today. Wow. Who is that? Yes. I have got from the high school, Rachel Lowe, who is, who is our homecoming queen. Oh, no. The, the queen? I, I am not ready. My, my, my helmet's not on right? I, I think you look fine. But again, I, I don't know if this is the queen that perhaps you're thinking of. This is our homecoming queen here at the high school. Oh, what is that? Well, I'll tell you what. Why don't I have Rachel tell you a little bit about that? Rachel, come join us. Hi there. Well, hi there, Rachel. What do you do at Lakewood? I do a lot. I'm National Honor Society president. I'm Alliance Club president. I'm food section leader. And there's a bunch of other stuff I do. Wow. So tell us a little bit about homecoming queen. Well, you win queen by your peers voting for you, you know. So, and then you walk across to your football stadium and you get announced queen and king. Wow, did you get a little dance with somebody? Yeah, I danced with our homecoming king, Chuck Chen. Well, I hope that I get to dance with somebody one day. Well, I suspect you will. I, I suspect so. But, uh, well, that's exciting. Yeah, Rachel is very, very involved here and we're happy to have her today. And, and Rachel, tell us, what book do you have for us? I am reading The Perfect Fit. Well, that sounds like a great book. Let's get to Rachel's reading of that. Today we're reading The Perfect Fit by Naomi Jones and James, and James Jones. This is a triangle. Triangle love rolling with the circles. But sometimes she felt a bit different. The circles didn't mind when Triangle accidentally bumped into them, but Triangle did. She felt like she was getting in their way, so she decided to find somewhere she could truly belong. Just around the corner, Triangle discovered some squares. Come and play with us, the square said. So Triangle did. They played all sorts of games, and it was terrific. Oh man, I, I love games. <laughs> Let's build a tower, one of the squares suggested. So Triangle hopped up to help, but they all came crashing down. Sorry, Triangle cried. It's okay, she said. The squares said, we don't mind. But Triangle did. She didn't want to spoil their game. She shook her head. I need to find somewhere I fit perfectly. Around the next corner, Triangle found some hexagons. Do you want to play, they asked. Triangle nodded. There were so many games Triangle could play with the hexagons. It was lots of fun. I love me a good hexagon. <laughs> Let's make a pattern, the hexagon suggested. Triangle joined in, but she kept making the pattern different, not the same. We can play something else, the hexagon said, but Triangle decided to say goodbye and keep on going. Triangle searched and searched, but couldn't find anywhere she fit perfectly. She was starting to feel very fed up. Maybe there aren't any other triangles. Maybe I'm the only one. But then she looked up and thought she saw a familiar shape in the sky. You're not a triangle, are you? Triangle asked. Almost, but not quite, the star said. Triangle sighed. Don't worry, there are shapes that look exactly like you, and they're not that far away. Finally, she found them, triangles that were exactly the same as her in every single way. She, rest, she rushed over to join them. T 
Together, they played lots of triangle games, and it was wonderful. What shall we do next? One of the triangles asked. Let's roll, triangle suggested. But none of the other triangles knew how to roll. As triangles tried to show them, she thought about all the fun she'd have with the other shapes, and it gave her an idea. You found the others, the star called down. I did, Triangle replied, and we had lots of fun, but I realized there was something missing. Everyone else. Oh no. <laughs> I used to think that I didn't fit in with shapes that weren't like me, but then I realized how much fun we're all missing out by not playing together. So would you all like to play with me? Yes. The shapes were very excited. <laughs> they all had a terrific time. The end. Wow, that was amazing. I know. <laughs> I hope that I can play with some shapes one day. It's all nice when we get along. <laughs> That's right. And remember, it's Lancer time. <laughs>